Heel. Heel. Come on. Good nice. job. Down. That a girl good down. Okay. Winnie, come. Yes. Good job. Okay. Winnie, go place. Nice job, buddy. I'm gonna pretend like I'm exiting out of this door. Oh, yes. Nice. <laughs> Winnie, okay, come. That a girl. Good job, buddy. Look at you. Sit. Nice job. Here's your treat. Good girl. Good girl, buddy. Good job. Good job. Come on. Winnie, down. <laughs> she knew. Wow. Uh, she knows. I don't know. Good girl. I'm going to take her. Um... Yeah, we might have a part two to this video. I kind of want to show you guys how she's doing inside the house. So I'll go ahead and leash her up and take her inside. We'll pause the video for a minute. Ooh, is that a, a doggo down there? That's that one that goes everywhere. <laughs> yeah. Like yeah. <laughs> That's awesome, buddy. Good work. Come on. <laughs> okay, let's go. All right, we'll pause again. We'll go inside. All right, everybody. We've just been hanging out in the house for a little while. Sorry, my house is a mess right now. Um, but I've just been hanging out. There's uh, my lawnmower guys out there cutting the lawn and stuff. So she's been looking around a little bit. So I'm just going to use this as an opportunity to call her over to me. Winnie, you can show. Winnie, come. That's a good girl. Good come. Nice job. Nice job. Good job, girl. That was nice. For me, it was really important to see her be preoccupied, you know, uh, with the mailman, UPS guy, or somebody messing around outside. I'm sure she's aware. So if she is barking or paying attention, I need to see her when I call her name and tell her to come. I want to see her disengage whatever she's preoccupied with and come to me. If in that situation right there, she did not start making progress towards me, then I would after giving the first command, I would be like, hey girl, I already told you once, if I have to repeat myself, I'm gonna press the e-collar button and then I'll say the command again. In that situation, she came right away. Good girl. Winnie, go place. It's over here. Good place. Good girl. We recently moved the place from that window to over here, just have better lighting. And uh, she's doing great. I will actually, do you want to go run around, like outside and knock on the door mm -hmm. to kind of see like what we got there? Mm -hmm. We'll just keep the video running and we'll just leave it on her and stuff. And then um, she can chill. If she's going to go out a door. So an opportunity to see how she'll do there. Nice. 
Good girl, Winnie. And again, all these things go back to the simple principles, right? Like I've told her a command, she's in her command. Variables may change, variables will change. However, my expectations that when I tell you to do a command, it stays the same, right? So you're in a go place, I don't care who comes in and out, I don't care if anyone knocks or anything. If I don't release you, then it's not your business to go investigate or do whatever behaviors you're gonna do. Uh, we'll just wait a little while while Anna goes around and knocks, there it is. She's definitely alert, she's definitely paying attention. You can tell she wants to do something about it, but she's just investigating. Hello? Hello. Okay, come around and knock on that other door now, that was good. <laughs> so we'll send her around to the back door and she'll knock on the back door here and then I'll actually leave her here and try to go open the door and come back and we'll see if she's still here. She's doing really good. I I'm super proud of where she's at right now. She's staring so hard. Yeah, there's windows that she can see outside yeah. too, so she's, she's hearing things. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Hold on. Uh-uh. Go place. Very good. Hello! Oh, hello there! Hello! Stepping <laughs> down my house! <laughs> Hi, girl. Good job. Hello, cute dog on place bed. So, even like right there, you know, um, this old habits are hard to break. So, she, she instinctively wants to go to the door, but that's not a big deal. It took, I didn't have to press the e collar, which, by the way, in the house for her is a. Uh, like six, seven, eight has been proper in my house for her out of a hundred. So it's pretty, pretty sensitive to the e-collar. So you have to be, you know, be aware of what her numbers are, where, and the numbers can change given any situation or distraction. So you, it's always a good idea to pay attention to where you're at. We'll talk a lot more about that kind of stuff when we go in for your uh, drop off. Winnie, okay. That's a good girl. Nice, good job. Okay, go on, free dog. You can do whatever you want. <laughs> you didn't have to do that, silly. Okay, come on. You go on. Um, yeah, uh, I wanted to kind of address a couple of things with her and make sure she really has a full understanding of it before I bring her to your house. She has a tendency to want to get really excited, and when she does, then she gets anxiety too. So then coupled with that, then... She kind of like you saw a little glimpse of it when you guys came in the beginning and then you saw her steady it herself out. I want that process to become a little bit smoother. And by the time we take her home, when she gets home, she's going to see home. She's going to say, oh, my God, I'm back home. This is where I do what I do. I'm going to go back and do what I used to do here. That's where I want to be able to intervene in her pattern and say, no, 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 that is not what we do anymore. We do the new things that you learned. And in order to make that transition that much smoother, I want to spend that time just taking care of this the little brain there. <laughs> um, hopefully this all makes sense, you guys. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Once you see it, if you have anything to talk about or any, anything to you know, want to know more about or anything, let me know, okay? Otherwise, we'll see you later.